Hello beautiful people. I've decided to show you these resources to learn malware analysis and reverse engineering. I think many people want to learn these skills but finding resources is always the hardest part. And not only that but sometimes finding resources is easy however we always get lost into it. So many information on what to do, so many things. So I've decided to show you these three resources that you need to get started so the number one is the practical malware analysis book for me i think this book is probably one of the greatest technical book ever written because it's so lucid straight to the point yet it doesn't leave anything out it's really simple to follow and uh, very practical because you have labs that are also included within the book where you'll be able to follow through with fake malwares and also i think the book is probably one of the when it comes to um, foundations of assembly language i think the crash course uh, the crash course assembly that they have on uh, chapter three i believe is the best it's really nice for introductory to malware analysis although the book is dated the concepts still remain the same most of the malware that you have for the labs are a little bit old however the concept still remains the same now if you want something that's more that's dealing with more modern malware i suggest you check this book here by uh, dylan barker it's malware analysis and techniques and that one i think it's probably like one of the best as well when it comes to dealing with modern malwares and um However, it doesn't deal well with foundational concepts, but this one comes directly from somebody who's been working in the industry and you see the way he, he goes through the malwares and the case studies in the book makes it a very good way to follow and also to see the day-to-day -day life of a malware analyst and reverse engineer because he uses the most modern tools available such as the Flare VM, and all the things that are there. And he also he deals with uh, a lot of the modern malwares that you have been seeing in the news. Unlike this one that um, that is more for foundational concepts, but also like you can you will be able to go really really in depth. Now, since we have these two, I think these two are the only books that you need to get started because here with this one you have all the labs that have harmless malware yet they uh, include all the different parts that the malware you see on news or anywhere that you have encountered do now this one here deals with modern malware they, may, they will be harmful so you have to be very careful however there are a lot of uh, ways to to get away with that and with this one, like uh, Sikorki and Mike, Michael Sikorki and Andrew Honig, this book has been, I think, the reference when it comes to learning malware. And I think I suggest that if you are really new, you just follow this week, this book to the letter. And also, if you are somebody like me who learns also learns better when it com um, with videos, now I suggest to you to go to Sam's class. Sam's class does info is one of the best website I think. It's, it's the most comprehensive website, website when it comes to learning um, uh, InfoSec, anything related to InfoSec, because Sam is a professor at uh, City College of San Francisco where he teaches so many classes and he has them all free on his website. Like right now, this is his website, samsclass.info, or you can go to the YouTube channel. So like, for example, this spring semester, you have so many classes, network security, computer forensic, ethical hacking information security exploit development securing web applications but what i suggest is that you go to all the classes here when you click it it's gonna bring you to this page so when you click on all the classes it's going to bring you here and then you will be able to see the last semester where he taught things and then you will find the practical malware analysis this one and this is um where you will be able to also f it's the same book that i showed here but with this one you'll be able to follow through with videos and somebody who's going through all the chapters in this book here so i think 
using that book will using the book along with these videos for sam is going to be very beneficial for you and you'll be able to learn so much because sam is a really articulate person and very passionate about the field so i think you'll be really able to learn a lot from him and as i said before these three sources this one practical malware analysis try to read it go through the labs really good and then if you want to deal with modern malware this one is good but i'll still suggest that you go through this because to me i think as a beginner this is really the best thing to start and then go through with uh, sam's videos see like these are all the chapters in the book and uh, you'll be able to find the pdfs so this is what i have to tell you today and just stay tuned like subscribe more videos are coming and you will be able to learn more about malware and i'll be dropping some uh, reverse engineering videos very soon thank you